what is up guys this is Tito back with another video and today in this video I'm gonna be showing you how can you use WhatsApp on a different device where you don't have a SIM card right now let me actually show you how can you do that I am on the WhatsApp beta so you need to actually download the WhatsApp beta if you're not on Play Store WhatsApp beta if you have not signed up for that as you can see right now it shows beta program is full if you have already joined the beta program it should be there already but if you have not let me show you how can you actually access the particular feature so for that just google whatsapp beta then scroll down and go to this apk mirror link i'll link it below in the description you should not worry about it so from here and inside this all releases on the bottom you will see the whatsapp beta versions and this is the one i think i'm using the november 18 2022 build and this is a 2.22.24.27 is the version and shows beta as you can see so i'll link it below and there are two variants of course let me actually show you which one to download so you will see you need to download this arm 64 v8a the bottom one as you can see it shows arm 64 v8a you have to install the apk in both of the devices which you are using and my sim card is inside this redmi note 10 pro but i'm using the whatsapp beta on the redmi k20 pro 2 so let me actually show you how to do that so again you can see the same version which i am on right now let me actually go back and from here if i show you this let me actually go into this link device and from here as you can see i have this android 13 device let me actually remove it so that i can show you from the beginning so on the redmi k20 pro let me just open whatsapp and i need to allow as you can see it shows you have been logged out because i just logged that out from right here and from here as you can see it shows link and device or link a device it shows so here it will show a qr code just like this and i will be obviously blurring this qr code but for you you should be having a qr code on the new device or where you don't have a sim card you will have this qr code then just tap on the link a device and here i have this app lock that's why it shows like this and it will open the camera to scan the qr code and i'll just hold like this so right now as you can see the scanning process is done and right now it is loading chats and once it's done as you can see all my chats and the status and even the calls should be appearing so yeah some icons are just like not showing up because it takes some time to actually load up but here in the settings of it let me actually go in the chats as you can see there is no chat backup option on this device but here all my chats has been synced you just need to make sure one thing that on both of your devices you have internet otherwise it will not work it's just like the whatsapp web on a pc or something so you need to remember that but right now we can of course send any message to anywhere let me actually send some random text to this and as you can see it actually works as you can see it has it should be added from right here too on both of my devices the chat has been added so yeah this is how you can use whatsapp on your device where you don't even have a sim card and you can do it to any device i think up to amount of 10 device you can actually connect so there you go let me in the comments if you found this video helpful so give this video a thumbs up if it helped you and share this video to your friends if you want to know to use whatsapp on a different device where you where they don't have their sim cards please subscribe to the channel if you have not yet this is Tito from kdn tech signing off for today and i'll be catching you guys in the next one